First at 6, police in Albany say they're investigating an assault on a young teenager as a hate crime. Police say the attack happened in Swanson Park in Albany. That's where Fox 12's Brenna Kelly joins us live, all new at 6. Brenna. Well, I spoke to the 13 year old's mother and father. They say their son was called racial slurs, and after he left, he was jumped here at Swanson Park. It was the bandwagon mob effect. It was, and it's horrifying, which is very, very scary. 13 year old Nehemiah's mother, Natalie Ward, says her son is the victim of a hate crime. My son was defending the fact he was black and he didn't want people to say certain things to him. Ward says what started as hurtful song lyrics repeated by Nehemiah's friends turned into a much more dangerous situation. Nehemiah left the skate park where he was hanging out and was then jumped by older teenagers who he didn't know. They called him racial slurs, beat him up and kicked him in the face. Nehemiah is a very friendly, good kid. Clearly he's been in no, in tr in no trouble, absolutely. So the the scenario, I mean, it was just, it was a, a nice kid who got bullied. Albany police say it happened last Tuesday here at Swanson Park. I wanted blood. You know, my blood was boiling. It's been a nightmare for Nehemiah's father, Junie Hart. That anybody, anybody from anywhere should be able to feel safe. You know what I mean? Or and should not be treated differently than anybody. He doesn't want to leave the house. Um, school goes back into full time in campus on Monday. He does not want to go into campus. Um, he doesn't want to really see anyone. Now, community members are standing behind Nehemiah, organizing a protest to stand against hate. We just want to be heard. You know, we just we we got people in this community that have a powerful voice um, and, um, you know, everybody's coming together. And Nehemiah's both mother and father tell me the Albany Police Department has gone above and beyond for their son. They're horrified by what happened, but grateful to see the community coming together for a protest to stand behind Nehemiah to Friday night at 6 o'clock. For now, reporting live in Albany, Brenna Kelly, Fox 12, Oregon.